Hi, I'm Angie Kellen for the eBeam Initiative. Tonight I'm in Saratoga, California at the beautiful Plumed Horse Restaurant for the eBeam Initiative's Luminaries Dinner. Now this annual exclusive event gathers all of the industry's greatest minds after a day at the SPIE Advanced Lithography Conference. Joining me is Dr. David Lamb. He is the founder and former CEO of Lamb Research as well as the current CEO and chairman of Multibeam Corporation. Welcome, David. Well, thank you. Nice to be here. Now, Multibeam Corporation has joined the eBeam Initiative over the last six months. And what are your views on why the eBeam Initiative is so important? Well, eBeam Initiative, I think, is very timely. Uh, first of all, it is uh, for educational purposes. It's nonprofit, so we can welcome all the other companies which participate in it to be members. And I think I can already see that they are encouraging eBeam Initiative has been encouraging collaboration among members. That's also very important. Well, I want to talk about the eBeam technologies. And uh, which of the eBeam technologies do you think are going to be playing a key role here? Well, certainly in lithography in general, uh, D2S, for example, has been working to bring innovation in, uh, into eBeam mask writing. Uh, Multibeam Corporation has been working very hard to provide the solution called SIBO or complementary e-beam lithography, which is using electron beam to complement uh, the current optical lithography. Now, David, are you seeing any other trends on the horizon where you think that maybe e-beam technologies might be used or required? I'm, I'm already seeing, in addition to mass making, as well as uh, e-beam lithography or SIBO, um, I'm seeing also the uh, use of e-beam in high throughput um, inspection. Now, eBeam has always had high resolution. A uh, good example is a scanning electron microscope, or SAM, but it's too slow. So today, uh, the need for high throughput, high resolution eBeam inspection is really increasing. So eBeam can be additional, uh, uh, adding innovation to that area. Multi-beam is working on that, and uh, we call it CB, so complementary eBeam inspection, uh, CEBI. Uh, CB and SIBO can be combined to provide a much more powerful solution to semiconductor manufacturing. Oh, well, very good. Well, I know the event is really getting underway here, and I know you want to get back to it. I want to thank you so much for sharing your insights with us and taking your time, and uh, we hope to talk with you again soon. Thank you for inviting me. In Saratoga, Angie Kellen for the eBeam Initiative.